Thanks mate, we're going to walk you through what you need to do when you first receive your quick change hydraulic pull again. With the cylinders, they'll come fitted with a factory fitted coupling. What you need to do is you need to replace them with the couplings that we supply you. How you do that is you need to hold the cylinder horizontally with the fitting vertically. Now you unscrew the fitting, Now and then what you've got to do is you've got to install the fitting that we've put in there. Make sure you've got thread tape on there first, screw it in there and then lock it down firmly, not excessively tight. The reason why we do it horizontally like this is we don't want any oil coming out of the cylinder and we want to minimise how much air is going into the system because what we have to do next is we need to bleed, bleed the air out of the cylinder. Again, same thing for both cylinders and also for the hose. Now, the female fitting goes onto the hose and again, same thing, thread tape on whichever end you need to do. We also recommend, we don't supply in the kit, but we also recommend you put in an, a water separator on your airline going into your pump. Now, how we bleed the air? We connect it up, we make sure that the fitting is vertical, the cylinder horizontal, then what we do is then we operate it to full stroke, that way we fill it all up with oil, and then what we do is then we drain it back and the air will go through the hose and into the pump tank. Okay, let's do it. Alright, so now we return it. Now all that air should have gone into the tank, but what we do is I recommend you do it a couple of times just to ensure that it is done, done properly and make sure you do it for both cylinders. Alright, what else you will see in the kit is our coupling. These cylinders will come with a plastic collar on there to stop the thread from getting damaged. Unscrew that off and then what you do is you screw on our coupling. Now we recommend you, you screw it on fully first to make sure there's no issues, all right, that the threads haven't been damaged in any way during transport or anything like that. Make sure that it goes home. Once it is home and you know that it's fine, what you do, unscrew it, get a bit of Loctite or some other brand of thread locker, put it on the thread, then screw it all the way home. Do that for both cylinders. Once you've done that, again, check it first. Then once it goes home, then come in and again put your thread locker or Loctite on there to hold it on properly. All right, now, your system is ready to go.